Great, that's been the goal for obviously years and years. It's something to dance about for all the stray dogs and cats in Michigan. To be honest, euthanasia is an easier answer. But according to shelters in Michigan, it's the wrong one. All 174 animal shelters in the state are now considered no-kill shelters. That's a long sought-after goal, according to Beth Wellman with the Humane Society of Midland County. This has been the goal for a very long time, and the Michigan Pet Fund Alliance has been uh, very active in pushing this and making sure that no-kill is in, you know, kind of in everybody's face. To achieve no-kill status, each shelter must adopt out or transfer 90% of their animals. And over the last decade, Michigan has come a long way. According to the Michigan Pet Alliance Foundation, in 2011, Saginaw County Animal Control euthanized 3,066 animals with a save rate of only about 30 percent. Bay County euthanized 2,305 animals that same year with a save rate of about 33 percent. Other mid-Michigan shelters like Genesee County Animal Control also had a high kill rate. But now all of them achieved the highest possible status, rehabilitating and adopting their animals out for a second chance at life. All of the communities are you know, animal centric. You know, we want, these are our pets, they're part of our family. You know, I don't want them to die in the shelter. You know, so that mindset changing has forced, you know, um, everybody to change. Now, Michigan is actually the second state in the entire nation to reach the no kill status. Delaware was the very first back in August. Reporting in Midland, Kate Nadolski, W1EM, TV5.